To get started, I just added a color map background to my timeline and added some text under the track above. Let's begin by selecting our text clip and going over to Effect Controls. Position the time marker at the start of your text clip. Increase the scale's values so that it's super zoomed into your text. I'm going to set mine to 500 then click the stopwatch next to scale to create a starting keyframe. Move the time marker to where you want your text to be zoomed in by changing the scale back to 100 to automatically create your second keyframe OK. And now when I play this back, have a nice and simple looking zoom text effect. To make it look smoother, click and drag to select both your keyframes, then right-click them and select Ease Out. One last thing you can do to make it look even better is go over to the Effects panel and type Directional Blur in the search box. Drag that effect on your text clip on the timeline. Then in Effect Controls position the time marker to the beginning of your text clip change with the blurred link so that your text looks slightly blurred. I'm going to set mine to 15. Click the stopwatch next a blur link to create a starting keyframe, go up to scale and click this little arrow to position the time marker at your scale second keyframe, go back down to blur length and change it to zero to create a second keyframe. Now our blur will end exactly when our zoom does all right and I want to play this back we have a nice looking zoom text effect. And that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.